Hey there all, Frank Omatic here once again today with a, another request for you guys. This one from Tycoon the Lamb. American Gladiators on the Nintendo. If you're wondering why I'm not skipping past this, it's because it will not let you do it. You have to watch through the credits here because I know no one's going to actually get to the end of this game. At least I've never done it. I just love the guitar hits when he jumps. Anyways, there we go. Let's see. Let's get this started. For those of you who don't remember, this is based off of a game show that was on the TV back in the early 90s and the 80s. And it's got some of the events. Yeah, let's start with the joust. Well, I think he's hitting on me. Anyways, for those of you who do remember the Joust from the show, you'll realize you'll quickly realize that this is only incidentally like it, in the sense that they're beating each other with giant uh, Q-tips. In the actual show, that right there would have been the end of it, barring the uh, pained scream of doom from the guy. There was no jumping across platforms to get to the next bit or anything. These guys are pretty much painfully easy to defeat. Whoops. Yeah, the jumping's actually harder than the uh, fighting is. <laughs> I don't usually miss those, but... Uh... Yeah, if they... You got three moves, but... Uh... Oh, it jumped me to the next guy. And that one I just grabbed there... Now I have the flashing Q-tip. One successful hit will knock out the other guy, unless he hits you first. There we go. And that's that. And you get points for the time remaining. Yep, well, let's get a power ball next. I d From what I remember in the show, I don't believe the female gladiators ever took on the male contestants, but I could be wrong. This is Powerball. If you run across the field, grab a ball, throw it into a bin to get points. It's one of the few of, this is the only event I can think of where you can't lose a life in any way. Oop. If the uh, guys running around like spastic assholes here hit you while you have a ball, you drop it. If you get one into every single container, you get extra points or a one-up or something, I don't know. It's really hard to do. That middle one's the one that's really hard to get him into. Unless you luck out like I just did there. Ah, yeah, you get a 1-up. Okay. Not that it really matters. Yeah, let's do Assault next. If you remember this one, you had your... Uh, you had to run to the end of the course while a guy was shooting tennis balls. You can take a few hits in this one. So can he. You can win either by... Oof, shooting him down, just like in the show, except he takes more than one hit. Or, by making it to the end of the course. And I just shot him down. I'm going to make a quick save state here, just so I can show you the last two events. Human Cannonball. This is actually really fucking hard. You get to jump onto the rope, and then jump off at just the right time to knock the other guy off there. And you have to do it multiple times. The higher you grab on the rope, the harder it is to time it properly, ironically. The first level isn't too bad, but it's the later ones that I guess nasty because they start getting able to block you really, just like that. <laughs> Damn it. This one on the wall are the ones I have the most trouble with, honestly. You can't move down the thing, which is the problem. Fuck. Fuck. 
<laughs> you can also run off the platform. Whoops. Wee. And there you go, game over. In which your guy still cheers like an asshole anyway, so, uh... Anyways, the other event is the wall. This one is purely button mashing. You just pound on the buttons and hold the direction to climb the wall. The other gladiators show up. The reason I have so much trouble with this, actually, is because I'm playing it on an emulator. As most of you know, on a PC you can't hold three buttons at once and have it do anything in most cases. And in this, that means you can't really move diagonally, which makes it trivially makes makes this event trivially easy if you can do that. As you can see up at the top getting closer to the top, they start trying to commit suicide to get you. Fuck. The worst part is when you fall, you go all the way back to the bottom. Anyway, since I'm probably not going to make it through this, I know there are five levels worth of events. I don't recall if there is an Eliminator or not in between levels. I do believe there is one at the end of the game, but I've never made it to the end of the game. I can usually some I can sometimes make it through level one, but after that, I I can't get anywhere. Part of the strategy is tricking them into killing themselves. Fuck. The glove lets you move around without having to pound the buttons, but I think you get the gist of what's going on here, so I'm going to cut it out here. This is Frank Amatic, signing off.